What's going on, folks? So the band Adventus has just released a new song here called Ire, and I believe this is their first single from a, a new album that they're working on and all that good stuff. So I'm looking forward to checking this out. I'm excited. So without further ado, let's give it a listen, shall we? Rangers, go. Aire que me levas, me transportas, me envenenas, me das la calma y el dolor. Aire que llegaste del abismo, me llevaste al paraíso. Dime a dónde iremos hoy Aire que me cuentas lo que has visto Asomado al precipicio Que hay entre la luna y el sol Aire que decides por ti mismo Si estás muerto o sigues vivo Deja de Ay, de que escapaste de una vida que te ahogaba por momentos y que algún día se apagó. Ay, de que te cuelas en mi pecho regalándome el aliento. Que algún otro desvació Aire que me faltas cuando duermo Y despierto de repente Sintiendo que ya no estás Aire que calmas mi dolor Que mantienes con vida mi corazón Que me das una salida que alivias las heridas que el viento me regaló Viento que sopla sin dirección Que respiras violento sin rendición Que avivas el fuego, que entiendes los miedos Seguir junto a mí Es grande el viento y este mundo tan pequeño Tráeme un poco de verdad Aire que llegaste a mi alma enterrado en un lamento Que alguien dejó escapar Viento si aún me amas en silencio, dame un soplo de aire fresco, una luz donde mirar. Aire que calmas mi dolor, que mantienes con vida mi corazón, que me das una salida, que alivias las heridas, que el viento me regaló. Que avivas el fuego, que entiendes los miedos de ir junto a mí Los dos 
Wow, quite the emotionally charged ballad there. And I enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. You know, I, I don't know the, I don't speak the language, so I, I don't know what was really being said, but you could feel it. You could feel it, you know, even without the music video. The music video helps kind of tell the story in a bit, you know, really kind of helps convey what's going on, even if you don't understand the language being spoken. You can kind of follow what is kind of happening there. But even without the video, if you're just listening to it, you can just, you can feel it, you know, and that goes a long way because with a ballad, you really, really want it to be charged emotionally, you know, that that's really the whole point. And sometimes it falls short, but in this case, I really, really feel like it lands because again, I don't speak the language. But I could feel the emotion in the song, in the music, in the vocals. You could you could just feel it. And they just did a really great job with that. You know, I love the whole beginning. I love the, the piano and all that. And then when the guitar chimes in, dun, 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 it just really brings a grit, you know, brings that power to it. And the keyboard does a great job of, of making it feel kind of grand kind of big you know really opens up the sound of the song so that it doesn't feel like it's closed in you know it really feels open and I just really enjoyed the the rhythm of the song it had a very nice rhythmic nature to it with through the guitars mainly and the the vocal delivery the vocal melody just very deliberate very rhythmic and I, I love that because you have that in conjunction with the keyboard that's opening things up and making it feel grand. So it's it's large, it's open, like I said, and you, you feel that rhythm. You know, you, you're kind of caught up in it. It really pulls you in uh, through that, that rhythmic nature. And so, you know, I just dig things like that big time. I love the vocals. The vocal delivery was great. I mean, you can just hear the emotion in his voice. Again, th these aren't things that's easy to convey because you have to imagine in the music video, he can act, you know, a certain way and all that good stuff. But my assumption is that he recorded the vocals to this song in a, in a vocal booth, like in, in a studio. And so capturing that emotion in the song you know it's difficult you're, you're just standing in front of a microphone and you've probably sung this song a million times already before you're ready to record it you've practiced it you've you know uh, like a, you you've practiced with the band you know you, you've done demos perhaps you, you've done all these things but then when it's time to actually go in and, and record it you, you got to still capture that emotion as if it's like the first time and he did a great job with it i loved his delivery his, his uh the quality of his voice it was just stellar and it hit you know it's easy to get on board with this song and i love the melody and just the nature of it that I keep going back to it, but that rhythmic nature really helps this song a lot. It, it helps it to be contagious and infectious, and, and so you get on board, whether you know what he's saying or not, through the music and through this, the vocal delivery, you're able to feel it, and to me, that's a job well done. So, yeah, I thought it was a really cool song. They did a great job with it. Uh, let me know in the comments down below uh, what you think of this song. And I've been impressed with this band in the past. That's why I wanted to do a reaction here, because I don't believe I've done a reaction to this band before. I've only listened off-channel. So I wanted to do a reaction here, and uh, I'm glad I did, because uh, I, I enjoyed this. So let me know in the comments down below what you think of this song. Have you been listening to this band? How's this song stack up to, to what you're familiar with? Or if this is your first time listen, what do you think of it? And like I said, I believe they have a new album in the works, so I'm looking forward to that, and I'll catch you all next time. Ranger, out.